In his book Italian Journey, Johann Wolfgang Goethe describes the islands of Lido di Venezia and Pellestrina as enchanted places where the beauty of nature meets the simple and warm hospitality of the people. Being the closest island to the city of Venice, Lido has been well renowned since the beginning of the 1900s. In that period, it became an elite destination, with visitors coming from all over Europe flocking there to enjoy, among other things, the inimitable style of the Lido signature villas that still represent one of the island's main features, a very distinctive mix of Art Nouveau and Art Deco elements with Gothic, Romantic, and Byzantine influences. Using the comfortable and frequent runs of the public transport boats, it only takes a few minutes to reach Lido from the heart of Venice. At Lido and Pellestrina, it is possible to enjoy several beaches, both wild and stylish private ones, all facing a limpid sea that has obtained once again in 2010 the Blue Flag Award for its clean waters and natural environment. These beaches have renowned therapeutical sands that are possible to be enjoyed in protected areas. Here, visitors can find the kind of relaxation or entertainment that suits them more, whether they prefer being close to all the facilities, restaurants and the most exclusive bars, or enjoy long walks on the shoreline, or even if they intend to explore uncontaminated natural areas, or enjoy the many sport facilities available. Sport activities are in fact one of Lido's main features. Immersed in the quietness of the green, caressed by the sound of gentle waves, the Lido's visitors can enjoy countless sport disciplines such as archery, golf, tennis, horse riding, with dedicated activities for both kids and adults as well. It is also, of course, possible to enjoy all sorts of water sports in the lagoon and at sea, according to one's preference. From kayaking and rowing to sailing or recreational fishing, always in a natural environment that will reveal many surprises, such as the wonderful natural oasis of Alberoni in the south or the bird sanctuary of San Nicolo in the north, where it is possible to enjoy bird watching of the local species. Beside the famous Festa della Senza, during which is represented the symbolic wedding of the ancient Dukes of Venice with the sea, at the Lido takes place the worldwide famous Venice Film Festival, a glamorous and international event not to be missed by both the great European and American movie stars and the movie fans, of course. Not to be missed as well are the spectacular acrobatic flight events taking place at the Nicelli Airport, a beautiful example of the 30s rationalism architectural style. These are only some of the many occasions of fun, entertainment and worldliness on the island. In every moment of the year, guests will find what can make their visit a unique experience. Pellestrina Island, easily reachable from Lido by boat or even with a short and delightful bicycle ride using the ferry, still keeps today its fisherman's hamlet charm and identity. 
its picturesque colorful houses, the long beach with an always clear water, are only some of the good reasons why to visit it and enjoy the place. Pelestrina, an island out of time where you can find yourself and live a new emotion among the beauty of the place and the friendly, welcoming hospitality of the people.